it's Melila Jafarsade with the latest news on Azerbaijan. President of Azerbaijan Ilham Aliyev awarded Fahad Alaskarov, the assistant to the Azerbaijani president for work with law enforcement bodies and military issues, upon his long-term activity in the civil service in Azerbaijan. Over the past 24 hours, Armenian armed forces again violated the ceasefire along the contact line between Azerbaijani and Armenian troops, reports the Minister of Defense of Azerbaijan. The minister also reports that the office of the personal representative of the OSC chairperson in office will conduct the next ceasefire monitoring on the contact line between Azerbaijan and Armenian troops on Tuesday. The OSC representatives will hold a monitoring in the direction of Azerbaijan's Karambay district. The Minister of Foreign Affairs of Armenia, Zohrab Nachakanyan, is trying to cover up his country's occupation policy by talking about democracy. Leda Abdullayeva, spokesperson for the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Azerbaijan, said while commenting on the Armenian minister's recent interview with a local media outlet. Abdullayeva said Nachakanyan can talk about human values and democracy only after Armenia ends the occupation of Azerbaijani territories. The spokesperson said, stressing that this country is far from showing respect for the principles of territory integrity and international law. U.S. cities Irwin and Portland proclaimed the 28th of May 2019 as Azerbaijan National Day. The proclamation signed by the mayor of Irwin, Christina Shi, and the mayor of Portland, Essence Sterling, praising the immeasurable contributions made by Azerbaijani Americans to the city's socioeconomic life. The documents note, Azerbaijan has consolidated its sovereignty and independence and has become a staunch ally and strategic partner of the U.S. in the critical important Caspian region. A dance ensemble and the horsemen of the state border service of Azerbaijan performed at the Royal Windsor Horse Show, marking the 200th anniversary of the birth of Queen Victoria. Their performance was full of fast-paced movements with tight turns and perfectly timed executions. The performance, choreographed specifically for the Royal Windsor Horse Show, demonstrated the strength of the Karabakh horse, the courage and peacefulness of the Azerbaijani people. That's all for today from Asfishan TV. Have a nice day. See you tomorrow.